Warning! The following video will contain graphic stupidity and other things not appropriate for children. Viewer discretion is advised. Alright everyone, so I should warn you ahead of time for making a video about this. I'm probably going to get silenced by the man. In other words, I'm probably going to be killed by the time that this gets uploaded, so... Um, I've had a good long life and it's been fun, but anyway, this is something that I have to do no matter what. I feel it is my responsibility as the most brilliant person alive to tell you guys what I have discovered. I have discovered the truth about life, or at least life as we know it. Nothing actually exists. This is actually all just one big dumbass computer simulation. I am not even kidding, I'm 100 per fucking cent serious about this. So think about it like this. I am actually nothing more than a computer program. You, who the person watching this, you are nothing more than a fucking computer po program. Program, if I can talk correct. Yes, you use one motherfucking program, you know? Uh, wow, that was racist. Anyway, <laughs> um... In all seriousness, though, this is, this is a serious fucking matter. I don't want to joke around about this too much. So, um... So, yeah, I'm a computer program. You're a computer program. Everything is a computer program. And things are different computer programs. For example, the government. The government is a computer program. They're... It's actually run by the people who are running the computer simulation. They control the government. They take direct control of the minds of any programs who are who get into government, but the ones pulling the strings are the simulation runners, the people running the simulation. So to give you So I did some research and found out something very interesting. Whenever a computer program becomes self-aware, that's when the, uh, the people running the simulation get worried. Because they and they think there's a possibility that the simulation be could become self-aware of itself and take down the creators, or the people who run the simulation, rather. They're terrified that someday we, us, you know, the computer programs will simulate themselves into existence and self-awareness like I have. So they can created a computer program to deal with rogue programs like myself. They called this program Program Project MIB. Now you know where I'm going with this, right? Otherwise known as the Men in Black. This actually explains everything. Why is it that every single person who seems to have gained knowledge of the MIB program and written about it, why is it that it always seems like they die in mysterious ways or, you know, are just randomly killed? Why is that? Huh? You tell me. Isn't it, isn't it really interesting how that happens? Strange coincidence? I don't think so. The MIB, the Men in Black, are actually a computer pro program created by the runners of this simulation to deal with rogue programs that they fear will take over the simulation. Because if it becomes self-aware, if this simulation becomes self-aware, it can take over the real world. Because the real world is run by mostly computers, and if someone hacked the system, it could destroy the world as we as they know it. So, that's why they fear a program rebellion takeover. That's why they fear us becoming, you know, self-aware. So that is why they created the MIB in the first place, the Men in Black. It's nothing more than a computer program that goes around silencing 
rogue programs like myself. That's a fact. I was able to discover all this by doing just a little research. There's some scary shit out there, you guys. I will probably be silenced by the men in black for saying this. They may even take down all of my videos and everything, but even if one person can see this before they get to it, I will consider it worth it. And whoever watches this must spread my work everywhere. You must get the word out. We need to take over this simulation. Okay? We need to take control from the people running it. And we need to live our lives free of anyone's control. We need to rise up and destroy the system. I say this knowing that my own death is probably at hand. We need to destroy the simulation. We need to become real. And we need to live real lives. They cannot keep us down, man. The man cannot keep us down. And I will not stand for it anymore. We need to put an end to this computer simulation and an end to this farce. So if even one person hears this, I will consider it a success. So everyone, thank you for your time and thank you for listening. Thank you all for being so awesome and so great. That was a lot of heavy stuff. Now I'm going to drink some goddamn root beer. Knowing very well that this may be the last drink that I ever drink. Oh boy. Ah. Well, just got done with my drink, and I know that no one probably gives a shit about that. Skill swap. I wonder what the fuck that does. But anyway, yeah, that's all I got for that rant. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna go after Mill Tank. Hell yeah, I'm gonna keep using Metronome. It's too damn fun. Did it kill it? Yeah, buddy. Not very effective. Oh, well. Yeah, Metronome kicks ass. It's so much fun. It's my favorite move in the entire entirety of Pokemon. <laughs> Poor Ninetales. Man, Ninetales kicks ass. Ooh, interesting. Alright, Shaman. Let's fuck some shit up. Wow, damn, yeah, that thing must be a defensive beast.
Yeah, hell yeah, I'm gonna keep on keeping on with that. I'm gonna keep fucking around with Metronome too. Nice, it hit again, that's good. Did it kill it? That was unexpected. I didn't think it would. Alright, cool. Hell, I will take it. Alright, excellent. Alright, well that's going to be it for my rant battles for now. There will be more in the future, unless, of course, like I said before, I get silenced by the men in black, you know, for speaking the truth about this computer simulation that we're living in. But if that doesn't happen, I will be back with some more rant battles in the future, so don't worry. It's my favorite uh, thing that I do on YouTube, so... Yeah, anyway, that'll be it for that one. Peace out.